Hey YouTube, welcome back. Tonight we're making pizza. Tonight I'm gonna show you how to make the absolute best pizza at home in just three simple steps. Let's jump right into it. First thing we gotta do is make our dough. You're gonna need a two and a half cups of flour, one teaspoon of sugar, one teaspoon of salt. You're gonna need one cup of water, about 110 degrees. You need one packet of yeast. We're gonna mix all this together with our kitchen aid. After we have it all mixed together, we're gonna take a little bit of olive oil and pour it over the top before we let it rest. While we let our dough rise, we're gonna cover it with a dish rag and you're gonna want it to grow until about double in size. Now that our dough is finished rising, we're gonna go on to step two, which is we're gonna make our pizza. We're gonna knead the dough first before rolling just to kind of get any of those extra air bubbles out. That'll help with the cooking process. After you finish kneading the dough, we're gonna go ahead and get our rolling pin and roll it out into our pizza. I'm gonna do a stuffed crust pizza tonight, so you're gonna to wanna to roll it out a little bit over the edge of your pizza stone, so that way you have enough to fold over and cover up your cheese sticks. Now that we've got our dough all rolled out, we're gonna take a fork and we're gonna poke a bunch of little holes in it. Next, we're gonna lay down our cheese sticks. You kinda of just wanna do a border around the edge. I did about half inch from the edge of the pizza stone so we can have a nice thick crust. After you lay down your cheese sticks, you're gonna take the edge, you're just gonna fold it over the top. Then we're gonna take that same fork and we're gonna kind of smooth out the edge of the crust so that way it kind of blends together with the rest of the pizza. Next, we're gonna make some garlic butter, that butter, and we're gonna brush it all over the pizza. Make sure you cover everything. Then we're gonna put on our layer of cheese. I'm using a Monterey Jack, kind of a spicy combo. Next comes our layer of pepperonis. And lastly, we're gonna put a layer of our pizza sauce on top tonight. We had a little bit extra dough, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna make some cheesy bites uh, to go with our pizza. We're gonna do the same process. This dough was already kneaded uh, when we did the rest of the pizza dough, so we're gonna just roll it out, put some cheese sticks in the middle, kind of fold it together the best you can, and then throw some cheese on top. Now that everything's prepped and ready, we're gonna preheat our pit boss to 425 degrees, and then we're gonna put on our pizza and our cheese at the same time, and we're gonna let them cook until golden brown, or about 20 to 25 minutes. Our third and final step is going to be just slice and enjoy. Tonight I've shown you how to make a stuffed crust pizza on your pit boss as well as some cheese sticks to go along with. If you've enjoyed this content, go ahead and check out this video right here where I show you how to make a life-changing Wagyu cheeseburger. Thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next one.